We frequently see customers using their digging buckets and grading buckets incorrectly. Now this can cause unnecessary damage and expense and wear and tear to the bucket that can be irreparable. Now in this video, we are gonna cover off what uses we do not recommend. So please stick around to find out more. One of the first issues is lifting concrete slabs. Lifting concrete slabs, patios, driveways, or even roadways can cause unnecessary stress to your digging buckets and your grading buckets. Using them in this manner can overstress the bucket, bend the teeth, bend the blades to a place where that bucket becomes unusable. Now we recommend a ripper tooth in this instance. Rip up the driveways using your ripper tooth, which is designed for stubborn and tough ground and then proceed to use your buckets in the correct manner. Now a perfect example of this, lifting the slab with the bucket, is in this video here. Yeah, okay, it works, but think of the stress you are putting through the bucket. We highly do not recommend this, as overstressing the bucket can form cracks in the weld which renders the bucket useless. So similar to that of lifting the slabs is the knocking in of fence posts. Now that we see this a lot, buckets that are caved in beyond their use. This is not what the bucket is recommended for and invalidates the warranty. We recommend that you use a correct post rammer for this job. Then it comes to digging in and around utilities. There are 60,000 strikes per year for underground utilities in and around construction sites. Construction sites and contractors are insisting on bladed buckets to prevent risk to operator in and around sites and utilities. We fully support this, but better still, the Rhinox UD Tusk the award winner at Plantworks 2017. The perfect tool for preventing strikes and protecting your operator in and around dangerous utilities. The last point is using the back of the bucket for grading. This wears down the bucket where there is least protection. We recommend that you use the grading bucket properly or even better still, the Rhinox grading beam. This is thicker and more durable and perfectly designed and capable for the job. Preventing wear on your buckets and also increasing the longevity of your grading bucket. So there you have it, a few of the common misuses for digging and grading buckets. For more useful content, please check out Ronox YouTube channel and don't forget to subscribe so you didn't miss a single upload. This is a video you can see here. Damage. I had a proper mind blank just then. It wasn't, it wasn't obvious, so it was... <laughs> don't start me giggling because I can't stop.